so lately I've noticed um, my water was getting very difficult to turn on and off this is the cold side and um, I thought maybe the cartridge inside was going bad sometimes when the cartridge goes bad it, that happens and so um, I did remove this handle to figure out if it's cartridge but um, I had a heck of a time removing this handle um, you know after after 11 years of using this there, there was some water around the bottom of this handle and I and of course with the water over, over time it, it deposits calcium and so I think this, this was sort of calcified onto this sink and so it would not budge when I was turning this the base counterclockwise to loosen it like my others it, this would not budge and so I found a tool on Amazon uh, it's called a non marring tool so I ordered this and it came today but I know right away uh, right off hand I knew that there's a flaw with this tool because it's too slick inside I understand it's non marring but it should have some kind of texture and it's too slick so when I when I wrap this around the base when I wrap it around the base to churn it when I tightened it up I tried to churn it it would just spin no grip whatsoever and so in order to add more grip to this I happen to have a roll of this um, uh, tool tray liner it has a little tackiness to it I think anything that has you can add anything that has more text any more tackiness to it will work so uh, whether you use a I, I, cut, I cut a little piece of this tray liner tool tray liner or you could get a um, one of those little jar openers that's rubber I think I think if you were to put any kind of rubber between wrap the rubber around the base of this faucet handle and then put this over that and then I turned it and that that added more friction and this allowed me to um, get this thing loose so this thing by itself it did not work for me maybe it worked for you but it did not work for me so anyways if it doesn't work for you add, add a little friction by again rubber glove wrap it with some rubber glove you know just enough to add friction um, those little jar openers so but this little tool chest liner work for me because it has some tackiness to it so that's the trick if that's the trick of getting this handle out I use the same trick to remove this handle this handle and one other all my bathrooms all of a sudden after about 10 years are getting more difficult to turn so um, what I'm gonna do with this handle is I'm gonna stick because I noticed when I got this off I've noticed this handle is very difficult to churn um, my left handle the hot side it turns it up with no problem and this but the right side this thing is actually kind of sticking really bad so I noticed this one has a lot of calcium deposit inside here lots whereas this one here is pretty clean so I'm gonna stick this one into a little Ziploc bag with the uh, distilled vinegar uh, to kind of break some of this uh, calcium off and get this to turn a little easier because um, that may have been the reason and not the cartridge but since I, since I have it off I'm gonna do both I'm gonna break the cartridge this has been a long time and then also I'm gonna um, soak this in vinegar okay thanks bye